everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing on Thursday afternoon, March the 8th. This is my Equibase Winter Circle East Coast Racing Report. Let's go to the Big A Aqueduct first for race 7 on their card today, 3.17 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a mile 70 yard test on Aqueduct's winterized inner dirt track. Four year rolls and up race for a claiming prize of some $46,000. Contenders number 4, Ever a Friend. Number 6, Day of Destiny. Number one, understatement, and number five, Saginaw. Number four, ever a friend, an eight to one shot is the pace profile leader in this claiming field. Racing at or about today's distance of a mile and 70 yards on the dirt has produced a quartet of power runs in his last five starts, hitting the board in three, including a pair of wins being embedded in this recent streak of racing consistency. Number six, Day of Destiny, a 10 to 1 bomb, takes a seven level class drop, is turned in four power runs in his last five, hitting the board in a pair, including a power run win in his fourth race back. Race seven, summary number four, Ever Were Friend, tops my contenders list today, which also includes number six, Day of Destiny, number one, Understatement, and number five, Saginaw, 4615 in the seventh from the Big A. Gulfstream Park, race one, the opener, 105 p.m. Eastern Post time, six and a half furlong sprint on the dirt track. Four year rolls and up race for a claiming prize of $25,150. Contenders number two, Todd Got Even, number seven, Star Player, number six, Penitent Prayers, and number five, Green Vegas. Number two, Todd Got Even qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony, takes a four level class drop. The overall speed leader in this claiming field, sprinting at or about today's distance of six and a half furlongs on the dirt, has hit the board in power run fashion in five straight, including back-to-back -back power run wins in his last two starts. Jockey Paco Lopez has been in his irons on three previous occasions, hitting the board in each, winning twice en route to a positive 137% return on investment in the process, back today for his fourth ride this afternoon. Number seven star player, the pace profile leader, is hit the board in four of his last five with four of those efforts, including a win in his fourth race back, also qualifying as power runs. Race one summary, number two, Todd Got Even tops my contenders list today, which also includes number seven star player, number six Pentinent Prayers, and number five Green Vegas 2765 in the first, first today from Gulfstream Park. Bonus long shots, Charlestown, race 8, the 4-1 to one shot. Number 3, My Girl Jules, takes a big class drop of some 21 track master units. The overall speed leader in his allowance field, sprinting at tonight's specialized distance of 7 furlongs on the dirt. Penn National Race Course, race 6, number 7, Poor Brecona. 10 to 1 bomb drops in class by two track master units. Speed leader in his claiming field racing at or about tonight's distance of 8 and 1 half furlongs on the dirt. So handicapping for both the Big A, Aqueduct, and Gulfstream Park on a Thursday. Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.